Jimmy Neutron in School Days. Hey, guys! Hey, Jimmy. Hi, Jimmy. Guys, you'll never believe what happened on Twonkus 3. A giant monster tried to destroy my rocket. He was absolutely huge with spikes on his head and these huge teeth, and we barely got the rocket started in time to escape. That's really cool, Jimmy. I gotta sit down. Yeah, that's real exciting. What's wrong with you two? I couldn't find any pets that don't make me sneeze. Yeah, and I got rejected from the school chorus because I'm terrible. Well, gee, guys, I'm sorry. Uh, anyway, the monster was throwing boulders at my ship, so then... Hey, Jimmy, um, why is there a soft, squishy thing digging itself out of that tank of stuff? Huh? Well, would you look at that? It must be a life form indigenous to Twonkus 3. Oh, he's adorable. I'm gonna call him, um... Oh, I know, a Twonky. Can I keep him, Jimmy? Can I please, please, please? No, Carl. Keeping a space creature is a direct violation of scientific protocol. Plus, it might be dangerous. <laughs> yeah, as if something that cute could be dangerous. <laughs> Like the Twonky's gone through some sort of metamorphosis. Guys, come on, guys. You're missing my solo. Ah, it's idiot. Um, Jimmy, I don't think he's very cute and cuddly anymore. scientific examination, I have come to the conclusion that we should run! Jimmy, look out! We'll go and try to find some help. Considering the circumstances, my hair looks pretty good. These plans should help. Sure, I can make something cool with this invention object. Don't you have any crazy inventions to help you this time, Jimmy?
Jimmy in Giant Land. Whew, that was a tight one, literally. I don't know how you find me, boy, but it's always good to see you. I should collect all the cool things from my locker first. Goddard has a locator scan mode that could be useful in finding stuff. Okay, boy, sniff around. Sniff out around here. <laughs> Keep up the good Stupor, an invention object. Nothing there. Goddard, fine. <laughs> Keep up the good work. This gizmo piece will come in handy. Covered boy, I'll see you later. I have to find out more about Plunkus 3. I wonder where those books would be. Well, well, if it isn't little Jimmy Nerdtron, come in for your daily pummeling, have we? No, Butch, I don't want any trouble. These horrible creatures have escaped and are tearing the school up. I have to find out more information on them. Oh, you must think I look stupider than I... Oh, no, wait, wait. Oh, okay. You must think that I'm stupider than I'm... Than I'm... <gasps> no, wait, that's not it. I'll tell you what. If you come down here, I am going to pound you. Oh, blast. I have to find a way to get past him before those creatures escape into Retroville. Hmm, all information on the Twonkus 3 reference books is in the teacher's database at the reception desk. If I stick to these plans, I can't go wrong. Ah, looks like somebody wants a pummeling. I want this gizmo piece will come in handy. This computer cannot currently access the database. I'm just too tough, Nerdtron. Live with it. Gotta hurry up. 
I warned you, Neutron. Now it's pummeling time! Ah! Looks like somebody wants a pummeling! Like books? Try this! You like books? Try this! Hey, that hurt! Stupid book! Hey! Ooh, these books are heavy! This one, Nerdtron, but you better watch your back! Says here the book I'm after is on the top level in the reference section. I better go and grab it. that doesn't allow certain sound wave transmission. I wonder if that information will come in handy later. It also says there are no known inhabitants. I guess this book needs updating. I don't know how you find me, boy, but it's always good to see you. Whoa, the Twonkies are multiplying. I'd better hurry. Okay, boy, sniff around. Keep up the good work, boy. A gizmo piece. All right. Congratulations, Jimmy. You have been awarded a trophy. Gotta see what you can sniff out around here. Keep up the good. Wow, an invention piece. The Twonkies are multiplying. Think, think, right blast. I, I better hurry. Goddard, fine. Good work, boy. A gizmo piece. All right. Think, think. Right last. <laughs> Yahoo! I wonder if I can write
write my name. Whoa, the Twonkies are multiplying. I'd better hurry. I'll see you later, boy. I have to attract those stompers away from the kids. really come in handy here. It's a bit dark in here. I should try to find the light switch. Well, the radio seemed to get their attention in the lab. I hope it works here, too. Right. By using my retro wrench, I can superpower the vent. Now let's power it up and see what happens. Now hold on. Wow, I might have made that a little too powerful. Oh well, at least the kids are safe now. Thank you, Jimmy. We'll wait here while you go get help. I've got to get those creatures away from Miss Fowl's classroom. Neutron. I could have guessed. Please, tell me this isn't entirely your fault as usual. Well... I knew it. Didn't I say that this had James Isaac Neutron written all over it? Didn't I say that? I did, didn't I? Indeed, you are such a clever man! Yes. Yes, I am. Now, these creatures are obviously dangerous and a threat to the students, so I am calling a school emergency! Oh, brother. Now, Jimmy, you exit through the main hall in a calm and orderly manner. Miss Fowl and I will go back and make sure there are no more children about. School emergency! We have a school emergency! People, don't panic! Leave in a calm manner! Please don't raise your voices and you won't be able to hear me yelling at you! Come with me! Follow me, but do not go! Run! Don't run! Get out of my way! And don't panic! I sure hope those creatures haven't gotten far. 
I better go home and figure out how to stop him.